Hi, I'm Camille. Today I'm going to show you how to add a moon to your Tree of Life pendant. Get ready to hit pause because here are the supplies that you'll need. I'm using a contrasting color wire just so you can really see what I'm doing with it. It's cut just a couple inches longer than the diameter of the pendant I'm working with. The first thing I like to do is to take my coin bead that's going to be the moon and just sort of figure out the best placement for it so that I can see once I have the wire going through it where my two anchor parts are going to be on my existing tree. I take my new wire and wrap it around the anchor point near the top of the branches making sure that the long end is going to go to the back of my design. Flatten down the little end and push this into position. Then I'm ready to add my bead. I add the coin bead to the back of the design and then wrap the long end of the wire around my existing tree. This will either be around a branch or around the trunk depending on the size of the bead that you're using for your moon. And then I just continue to wrap this new wire around the branch down to the trunk, then around the trunk down to the roots. And once it's in position, approximately even with the top of my roots, I'm going to trim off just a little bit so I have maybe an inch overlapping the edge of the circle. And then wrap the end around the circle like another root. Flatten down the little end, and if my other roots are bent, then I will go ahead and bend this also, and when you use the same wire that you're using for the rest of your tree, it will blend in and you won't be able to tell that you've added another wire. And that's it. Very easy. Hi, I'm Camille. 